Hi guys, I'm Katie Wayne and this is Animalist News. This week, a group of scientists at Columbia University tested rats in Manhattan for germs that can cause disease. Not only did they find a ton of them as expected, but some were completely new to science altogether. Lol. And that led us to ask, what about Ebola? Could rats get Ebola from infected sewage and then infect humans, almost like a modern bubonic plague? The answer is yes, it's hypothetically possible, but it is super unlikely. To investigate the factors that make it highly unlikely, we consulted with Dr. Charles Chu from the University of California San Francisco School of Medicine. First, the virus would need to find a suitable animal host to infect. Rats could become those hosts since they are known to hang out in sewage, but tests on lab mice show they aren't well adapted to the Ebola virus. They are more likely to die from Ebola than carry the virus as a host. That said, it is unclear how the virus would affect wild rats like the ones in New York City. Second, the rat would have to come into contact with infected sewage carrying the virus. This seems plausible because according to the CDC, contaminated waste from Ebola patients currently goes into the public sewage system where it eventually reaches the treatment plant. However, the waste disposed from Ebola patients at the hospital at Emory University in Atlanta was disinfected with bleach prior to even flushing, minimizing that risk even further. In other words, in order for rats to become a reservoir, they need to be open to infection in the first place and successfully carry and pass on the virus without dying first. And they'd also need to be unlucky enough to come into contact with infected waste containing the live virus in the sewers, assuming that the waste wasn't already treated with bleach. So while hypothetically possible, the chances are low enough that there isn't a reason to worry about it becoming a reality. To learn more about how animals and humans played a role in this Ebola outbreak, watch this episode. How could this outbreak be our fault? One word, deforestation. I love you all, and I'll see you next time. Bye. Mwah.